So some quick shout outs, uh, what's been good, what's been worth watching, uh, first of all, um, I really want to shout out some videos that I've, that I've favorited lately. A uh, new channel um, that I actually discovered through uh, Rocket News, he was featured, it's called That Japanese Man, Yuta. He's a journalist and author, blogger, and he does. A, he's got a YouTube channel. He's uh, only got uh, 1,000 subscribers at the moment, but um, he subtitles videos, and he, he's done a great video uh, where he surveys for eight minutes, interviewing Japanese women about what they think about dating foreign men. Um, so it's kind of interesting content. I haven't seen the whole video yet, to be honest. Um, however, it's a small channel. It looks really a topic of interest to international viewers, so I'm going to put a link below this um, to watch that, but that looks pretty cool. So yeah, go check that out and subscribe. Always good to find a new channel. Ken the Gaijin, that we already fe I already featured him on uh, Tokyo Tonight the other week. Uh, I'll mention it again. He just uploaded a new episode today, episode three. You got to have fighting spirit, and, and it's the best in the series so far. I, I told I told him that as well uh, afterwards, and he actually he told me as well. He told me to look out for this episode, uh, the one with the female Japanese female pro wrestlers. It's awesome because it talks about some history stuff about Ricky Dozan. Um, it features a foreign uh, female wrestler as well as, well as Japanese. And uh, I love his angle and the whole thing on the series. This was fun and the best edited yet. It was really good. And it, it's a professional grade series. So if you haven't seen any of them yet, go check it out and go and check this episode out because that's awesome. So the link is below. Um, next one is actually that I was just watching. Uh, Rhyming Gaijin. I want to get Rhyming Gaijin on a video because I really love his stuff. I just was watching in my... You know, my um, my feed the other day, uh, he did a remix of uh, You Know I'm No Good, uh, Amy Winehouse track, which he did with someone else, um, you know, singing in it. In fact, her name is uh, Lana Laborini. Uh, I think she's Italian, but anyway, it came out really, really awesome. Uh, the, I noticed actually the, ba the backbeat for it. Um, I'm not sure if that was, this was the original use of it, but it was the same backbeat that was used in CB4 for the song Sweat From My Balls. And so just from that, I got very excited, um, but I, I love all the stuff that he makes. And yeah, it was it was pretty cool, so check that out. And um, oh yeah, maybe two more things, two more two more people I'm going to shout out. When I was in the YouTube space the other day, YouTube space is awesome, and I'm getting the hang of using it now. Uh, one is that uh, I, I saw Sasaki Ase there. Uh, she's, she does mostly beauty and cosmetics and stuff like that. And she's lovely and she's awesome. Um, and yeah, it was good. She I hadn't seen her for a long time, but she recognized me. And yeah, she is actually, I mean, you know, she does beauty for a reason. She is one of the most beautiful Japanese video bloggers. She doesn't do anything in English. Um, however, I, I noticed uh, looking through a channel recently that she's actually doing a, a, a wider range. She's doing food reviews and she's done a, a, she did a video talking about different types of relationship kind of questions and situations, talking with a, a, a guy. But she was using the green screen room there in the YouTube space uh, in that video and she's wearing like a space suit. And I just thought that was awesome, so I favorited it. Go check it out. Uh, and if you understand Japanese, it will all the better for you. But honestly, you can probably watch it even without that. She's really, really awesome, actually. And it's great that she's doing such a wide range of videos. And she's one of the mega. She was one of the first people to be lifted up and supported by YouTube. And she really is one of the mega channels in Japan, for those who don't know. And the final person I'm going to chat out, chat out is another person I, I, I ran into in, in the uh, YouTube space. We came down the elevator together. She was shooting in another room while I was shooting there the other day. Her name is uh, Aimi Sekiguchi, Sekiguchi Aimi Channel is the name of her channel, link is below. Um, she does a whole sort of range of vids, you know, she's very, very cute, does lots of sort of uh, all, all Japanese oriented videos, but one thing I noticed uh, when, when she was shooting when I was there was, um, and that video hasn't been uploaded yet, but she was using a 3D doodler, basically like one of these 3D pens that have been featured on a lot of the tech blogs lately. Uh, that you can create 3D objects with this pen, which kind of creates, uh, um, kind of, uh, you know, it's, it's kind of like candy. It comes out soft, and you can, but you can shape it into 3D shapes. And she made like a unicorn or something. It was like awesome. It blew my mind. And I was talking to her. She's really, really lovely. And her channel, I checked out her channel. And she does some really, really kind of, um, <laughs> she's good to watch. She's good to watch. So uh, I, uh, another channel to shout out and to check out. These are all big channels, but I, I want to feature some smaller channels as well. But in any case, that is, um, yeah, some shout outs and stuff. This has gone a bit longer than I thought, so I guess this is going to be the second of two videos. But um, yeah, um, I'm, I'm, every now and then, I'm, I'm going to create some templates so I can do quick and easy vlogs like this, as well as um, uh, my, my regular long videos. Make them, 
you know, up upload some content that's a, that's a bit random, but is a bit easier to watch, a bit more edited. So I hope you enjoy this. I'm gonna do this a bit more often. Friday Night Gaijin. This is it, the start of the new thing. Oh, I do like my T-shirt. It's pretty cool, isn't it? This is the kind of thing that I'm playing with. Although I'm gonna try to do this quick and easy. Um, let me know if there's any channels or if there's any videos or anything that you know I should be shouting out on this. Uh, I'm particularly interested in channels. Um, so I'm, I'm really it's one of my news resolutions to get into back onto the top of content. Uh, oh yeah, one other thing, person I, I, I want to shout out really quickly um, is um, Grace uh, Texan in Tokyo. Uh, apart from having a channel which you all know about, there she's also she draws comics and stuff, and she's been getting featured a lot on Gaijin Pod lately. Uh, and I love everything that she's done. Basically, she talks a lot about stereotypes uh, that foreigners have of each other, about the anti teacher, yeah, Gaijin teacher, uh, English teacher thing. Um, as well as, um, yeah, it, it's kind of, it's a, it's a, it's a Gaijin perspective on Japan comic. It's pretty well done. And she's written some great uh, blogs on Gaijin pot, so go check that out. And that's it. Okay, I'm going to um, slide out, edit this up, and see how it looks. Talk to you later. Peace. Boom.